going to be a little different. First of all, last night I fell asleep at midnight and woke up at 4 and I finished editing my vlog at like 6 a.m. and I just couldn't go back to sleep. So my original plan was to film a sunset up at the Basilica today. But when I looked outside, I realized that it wasn't really the best day for filming sunsets, you know? Sunrises, oh my god, why do I mess those up all the time? Bad Dobby. So, not quite the morning I have planned, but I'm still going to be productive. <laughs> Wakes up at 4 a.m. Still manages to be running late for an 11.30 class. How do I do it? A few moments later. Okay, so I'm just here outside of Confluence Mall. I just finished my human resources class. I actually got a pretty good grade on the test I did last week. So I'm really happy with that. I expected a lot lower than what I got. So it's good. Even though all my courses are pass or fail, it's always nice when you get a good grade. And hopefully that'll make up for my bad French one that's coming up. There's actually a lot of like police cars out today. There was just two right there. And then there were four police officers going in the front. Then there were like security cards all running around. So I figured I'd just wait out here for a couple more minutes until like that all kind of cleared off, which I think it has. Just in case, because like you never know in France. Barcelona is coming up pretty quick. I leave Friday, which is two days from now, so I'm just here to pick up a couple food items. I might make my famous trail mix again with peanuts and M&Ms with peanuts inside. The longer I wait out here trying to finish this, my mouth gets more and more frozen, and I start getting a lisp. As I said, it's getting pretty cold here, and everyone in Canada keeps on reminding me that it's not that cold and they keep on sending me pictures of snow and like temperatures in the minus degrees well here it's still like five or six but barcelona is supposed to be pretty sunny so i'm looking forward to that 18 degree weather who knows maybe i'll go swimming yeah i'll see you guys in there or maybe at home or who knows the store is certainly all set up for christmas already that's exciting I really needed this nap. Is that special K stuff with like the strawberry with red berries? That's what I had for breakfast. I put honey on top though. Wow. Okay, and now I want to talk a little bit about like getting better at things. So I am currently watching a video on color correction versus color grading. I'm learning how to use Lumetri color panels. I think that's what those are called. So well, a big part of daily vlogging is actually getting out there and filming everything and trying to tell like a story every single day. Another part of it is editing video and I try to make each video better than the last and I know it does not always work. Big problem with daily videos is that I need to be creative daily and I'm not quite sure I just have it. But aside from trying to tell better stories and be more creative in my storytelling, I do try to improve my editing skills. So one of the things is color grading and color correction. It's like small things that I think like make the video slightly better. So even though you don't notice like all the small things I do, I think it makes a difference to the overall experience in the end. So for example, this side won't have any color correction and this side will have color correction. You see, there's not like a huge difference in between them, but it's like small and subtle. And then if you add color grading on top of that, which I'll do right now, then it creates a totally different look compared to previous. And back and so adding small things like that I think make the film better and for me the best place to learn is on YouTube I actually have been watching YouTube videos to learn since I was like a little kid in all my math classes my biology classes when I wanted to be a pilot I always watch YouTube tutorials on how to do all these different things and now that I'm into filmmaking I always watch videos on editing on how to shoot better things. I watch a lot of camera and gear reviews because I love cameras now. Even though like I knew nothing about cameras six months ago, I feel like I could tell you a lot more about cameras now and I've never taken a photography class or anything. I just have watched YouTube videos. So it's kind of no surprise that I make YouTube videos considering I have been watching YouTube videos since I was a little kid. 
Anyway, yeah, that's kind of the final thought for tonight. Hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Hopefully the colors in it were a bit better as I was learning a little bit about it today. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Hopefully my videos continue to get better. I'm always trying to cut down editing time, but make the edits better. So hopefully I'm slightly succeeding in that. I just want to give a quick shout out to everyone that continues to watch my videos. I really appreciate all your comments, your love, your support. It means a lot because I know you guys take like 6 to 12 minutes out of your day to sit down and actually watch me just ramble on and try to make videos. And I really appreciate it because I know time is valuable and you take some of your time to watch me, which is super nice of you. Um, so hopefully you guys continue to watch and hopefully I continue to get better so that watching isn't a chore and it's enjoyable. Yeah. See you guys later.